chatbots are incredibly useful tools that allow streamers to create commands to engage with their viewers easily and to moderate the chat in real time. But did you know that Streamloot has its own chatbot that allows you to send alerts to your chat regarding Streamloot's activity and even automate some of the interactions in your cards? Stick around and you'll know how to do this and much more. How's it going everyone? I'm your host The King and welcome back to the Stream Loot channel. If you didn't already know, chatbots are amazing bots that you can add over to your Twitch that allow you to engage with your viewers through the chat box automatically. You're able to set commands to trigger specific actions and this has the objective of making it much easier for your viewers to get information from your channel without that much of a hassle. It can also even help moderate the activity in your chat. The list goes on and on with the fantastic amounts of commands that you can add to your stream with chatbots. And did you know that Streamloot's actually created their own chatbot that you can add over to your own Twitch account? With this, you'll be able to provide alerts to your stream in real time so that your chat will be informed of all the Streamloot's activity as they happen. Make sure you stick around to the end because the Streamloot bot actually takes it a step further when it comes down to automation. So without further ado, let's get started. And do remember, we do have a Discord that is available for everybody to join. The link will be on screen right now and in the link in the description. Make sure you guys come on over to the Streamloot's Discord channel. It's actually really easy to set up and start using the Streamloot chatbot. As a first step, when in Streamloot's, access your creator dashboard and then on the side menu, pick alerts and widgets. And remember, if you have been using Streamloot's for a while, you'll know that that you need to have the alerts properly configured in your OBS. If you just started and you don't have them yet, make sure you go to your alerts first to make the proper setup and insert them as a browser source. In the alerts and widgets menu, you'll see the chatbot option, which you'll click to go next. Here you'll find a quick description of what every toggle and feature can do. As a first step, it's essential that on your channel, you enable the Streamloot's bots as a moderator on your Twitch page. From there, you can choose the action you allow the chatbot to create on your stream. You have the card alerts, which basically will show every single time a card is played in your chat. The purchase alert, which alerts your chat every time someone has purchased some packs. The ranking alerts, as well as the bidding alerts. I'm sure you guys know about those as well. We made a whole dedicated video to bidding, so make sure you check that out. All of these can be configured with the chat button and they will show up in your chat once enabled. And remember, you can configure this to your liking as well. If there's certain things that you won't be using or you don't think will be utilized on your stream, you don't have to turn them on. So on the right side, you'll be able to see which actions are currently turned on. And don't forget to save changes. So we just showed you how to set up the chat bot to your stream. This is the basics of the stream loots bot, but there is a much more that it can do. Now we're going to show you how you can assign card specifics to these chatbot commands to align with your Twitch chat. It's pretty incredible. First, go to any card in your collection that you want to assign a chatbot command to. Click on the three dots in the top right and click edit card. There you'll find add integration button and there you can select the chatbot. With that selected, you can now choose three options. Default shows on chat, this card has been played, silence, chatbot disables alerts for this card, and custom message. It's where you can add more flexible and valuable options. With this, you can choose to trigger a specific message set by you, or you can combine it with Twitch chat commands so the card sets one action. For example, when the card is redeem, it activates slow mode. You can select pretty much the majority of Twitch commands to integrate with this chatbot this way, that can give you a lot of options. Find the list of Twitch chat commands in the description below. And remember, the possibilities are truly endless with this as well. If you're a very innovative streamer, you can do a bunch of different things. I personally have commands and channel rewards that allow you to change the lights of my computer and the lights around me to trigger on-screen alerts, and you can combine all of this with cards. It's really amazing, and the possibilities are truly endless to what you can do. And that's quite great. But did you know that you can go even beyond just Twitch chat commands? That's right, as posted on the Streamloot's blog, there's actually many ways that you can use the Streamloot's bot to create automatic interactions. 
For this, you'll need to use Lion's Board in addition to the chatbot, which basically acts like a virtual stream deck. We've also placed a link for that in the description down below. And the blog post down below, we provide you the button setups that you can use to replicate these examples as well. So some of the popular things that you can do with this is creating the camera colors or the devil effect as we call it and you can easily download this effect yourself with the preset in the blog post down below by doing this it will invert the color scheme on your camera and provide some very spooky moments which can be easily used when you're playing survival or horror games we also have fun other commands such as muting your mic for 15 seconds that easily can be toggled with cards and again don't forget that you can download these effects for absolutely free it will be all linked in the blog post. And there you go, guys. You now see that the possibilities of what you can do with the Stream Loots chatbot is only limited to your own imagination. These examples that we have shown you can be adapted and integrated to your very own liking to suit your own streams. We're looking forward to hear from you in the comments as well. Which automations are you most excited for to try out yourself and what ideas are currently brewing around in your head? Drop it all in the comment sections down below or join our Discord as we mentioned to plot some ideas down there. But my friends, that is pretty much going to wrap it up for today's video. I hope you guys do check out the chat bot. It is absolutely fantastic and you're going to have a great time, but that's going to do it for me. I've been your host, the King, and we'll see you guys next time. Take care.